Have you ever wished you could go back in time and right a couple of wrongs? BYU TV's animated series, Saving Me, tells the story of tech tycoon Bennett Bramble, who spent most of his life making selfish choices. So he travels back in time to help his 11-year-old self do the right thing. For every Saving Me animated character, there is a voice actor creating the character's personality. Let's meet some of the cast, including the actors who play old and young Bennett. So one of the decisions we made early on in the show was to cast older actors to play children. There's an understanding that comes with adulthood, but that comes with experience. Voice actors are a very specific skill. You know, we auditioned a lot of people to try to find the right voices. Does this voice actually feel like it has emotion and personality to it? And their job is to bring that consistently, episode to episode, without actually ever having seen the, the character movement, but it was up to them to really imbue those characters with life. Here's a to-do to die today at a minute or two to two. Hi, I'm Adam Sanders. My character is Bennett Bramble. Test flight number 87. He's an 11-year-old prodigy, super whiz kid. You ready, Eddie? As a voice actor, when you're creating a character and creating a voice, you want to strive for authenticity first. Beyond that, I think about like how fast the character speaks, how fast his mind operates. No, not sweet. Why should you get signed? Basically just working around those, those concepts to create a voice. Whoa, 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 are you serious? Sophie is a showman at heart, and I can relate to that. It's the criminals of the world who should be afraid. She is loud and unapologetic and very theatrical. That can get on the nerves of her family and get her into lots of sticky situations. Whoa, a real studio. She is just a big, bright ball of light. Good night, Bennett. One of the big misunderstandings, I think, about voice acting is that, you know, it's about how many voices can you do? And which isn't about it at all. It's choices, not voices. You have to play the part of this character in this situation. We're told we're not looking for cartoon voices. We want realism. And what more real than your own voice? So for me, you know, o old Bennett, it's me, but he's just got a bit more gruff to him. That's all. It's just me. Yeah, well, here's a dose of reality, kid. The top ain't great. Stay back! Being a, a voice uh, actor as well, one of the things I, I, I love about being a voice director is that I know what the actor is going through on the other side of the glass. Hopefully, I'll be able to express what the character requires, and I can express that to the talent in terms that they will understand. Uh, if only you could hear what I could hear. The animation concepts um, helped a, a great deal. When I saw Nero's sketch, I knew who that child was. I also know this hairstyle that she has. I'm like, these are plaits, these are up fast. I'm like, okay, so she's all around, she's busy, she's on the move. So that really, it really helped me find her physicality just from the picture and also finding out what kind of child she is. Big mouth might give a different sound, big bodied character might give a different sound, or you can go against the type, you know, if you see someone who, like a really tiny shriveled up character, you might think, oh, I'm gonna go really small with this character, I'm gonna make him sound like this. Or you can go different and go, if this big voice came out of this tiny little teddy bear, you know, you get something like that, it's kind of cool. And this is one of the only shows where I get to use my own voice. How about just me with a smile? And there you go, that's where it came from. Wait, was that a rhetorical question? <sighs> we wanted all of our characters to be authentic and to really capture both the innocence of childhood, the regret that we feel at our mistakes, and the sincere desire to get better. Enjoy the voice talent of saving these kids. Thanks for watching BYU TV Insider. Mm -hmm.